y'all so much for staying around the rest of the night with us. You got to hear Randy do that. That's cool. So being Sunday and all, I'm a little Sunday service. How about that? I want to tell you right now, I got to testify about something. I am so blessed. I'm a blessed man. I'm blessed in so many ways. I'm blessed to get to play up here on this stage with these guys. I'm blessed to get to hang out with you. And I'm, where's, there's my favorite blessing right there. There she is right there. That's the one that takes care of me right there. I'm blessed. So I just want to acknowledge that I'm blessed. I'm not lucky. It's not coincidence. I'm blessed from above. Because I claim Jesus as my Lord and Savior. And I am. I have never regretted that. I never regretted that day. Man, oh man. Before that, I was trying to do things on my own. It wasn't working out. So I turned it over to him, and everything's been working out just fine. Everything's been working out just fine. So I was going to testify about that today. I want to tell you, though, that your life is a precious thing. Each and every one of you are created for a purpose upon this earth. You're not just some random chance of being here. You're not just atoms that floated around and got together and over a billion years. You were created. You were created wonderfully and fearfully made. I know that because each of you have a different fingerprint than the other one. Everybody's fingerprints are different. That's randomness that's unexplainable, isn't it? Okay. Something to think about. But I want to tell you that your life is precious and, and you have a purpose here. And, you, and if you don't know what your purpose is, I can tell you what it is. Your purpose is to love. Your purpose is to love each other. Your purpose is to love the Lord and to love each other. That's your purpose. If you're not doing that, you're part of the problem and not part of the solution. I just want to point that out today. You're either part of the problem or you're part of the solution in this world today. So. It don't mean you're perfect, you don't have to be perfect, you just be who you are, enjoy your life, but try to reach out and love somebody every once in a while. Try to think of somebody as uh, somebody that you might be able to get along with, or you might be able to be friends with, or all those kinds of things. Put your, put your mind and your, and, your, and your attention upon love, and this world will be a better place to live. I know that's an old story, and that's an old tale, but it's the truth, it's still the truth, it's been the truth for millions of years and it's still the truth. You know, you don't know how many you don't know how many more times you're gonna breathe your breath. You don't know how many more times your heart's gonna beat. So you want you want to fill every moment of your life with life. Whatever you did yesterday is gone. You don't know what tomorrow's gonna to bring, so all you got is right now. That's all you got. So grab a hold of it and hang on to it until your last breath upon this earth. But I gotta tell you something, I gotta confess. I am a sinner, yes I sin, but I got a friend in Jesus. So you know that man alive is gonna send me up to the sky.
Sex. 